An additional accessory for both the DK5 and the DK6 series is the DK5 slash 6 dash COV, COV standing for cover. So these covers are designed for storing the face shields in the armory while they're on the helmets. So while the helmet is still uh, mounted with the face shield, take the face shield, slip the cover over it, as I'm demonstrating here, and wrap the Velcro tab over the top and secure it to the interior. There's three tabs. Now the face shield is well protected front and inside with this cover and can be stored. An additional accessory to the DK5 and 6 product line is model A-DK5-6-C. The dash C indicates that it's a clear cover lens. This clear cover lens has self-adhesive strips that when you peel this white paper off, exposes the adhesive, you can lay this onto the face shield and secure it in place. We also have a tab for quick removal, as you can see right here. This prevents deep scratches onto the face shield when it's in use, and if the rioter was to spray your face shield with paint or throw some sort of a material that would block your view, such as mud, you can simply reach up, grab this tab, pull this unit off and you'll have an immediate clear view. An additional accessory is the DK5 HM kit. This is a situation where you've already purchased the DK5 face shields and you have the strap assembly that I had demonstrated the attachment method for and you've decided that you would really like to do is put a hard mount to your helmet. So we sell this as, a, as a, uh, an accessory kit has all of the hard mount componentry that's necessary, replacement screws for your chin strap, new screws for the headband, and a complete instruction kit that explains how to attach it to your helmet. Again, the purpose of this kit is to convert a standard DK5 shield that has the strap assembly on the back to the hard mounted assembly on a basket helmet only.